So here we are in data center one, where we've installed the LoRa cabinet thermal map. So the LoRa sensor um, and antenna is up on top of the rack there, you can't see it, but here we have our string of um, three sensors at the front. There's three at the rear. This gives you uh, temperature, top, middle and bottom, front and back, humidity, front and back, as well as the delta T temperature differential from the front to the back of the rack. So we can make sure that all of the servers and equipment in here is running at the right temperature and we haven't got any hot spots. So this data is being collected and broadcast over LoRa to the LDSIM, which is, which is installed over at uh, data center number two on the fourth floor of another building here in the campus, which we'll go and take a look at now. So here we are in data center two at uh, Big E Food Corporation. We just installed the LD SIM here in the rack and at the back of these cabinets we've got a uh, LoRa uh, battery power temperature humidity sensor. So this LD SIM is receiving the LoRa data from several other sensors that are spread around the um, factory area and in their other um, data center in another part of the building. So we're up on I think the third floor here. Um, out the window over there is the rest of the uh, site and um, in the other building, uh, across from the trees here, is the uh, um, site of Data Center 2, where the LoRa cabinet uh, temperature, humidity sensor, and thermal maps have been installed. set up and uh, we've now logged into the LD SIM and uh, you can see here the AKC Pro server user interface with uh, the cabinet thermal map being displayed here with the temperature differentials coming from um, the thermal map we've got installed up at data center number one as well as the status we can see it's reachable um, so we're getting a good signal and uh, everything's good to go. So uh, that does it for um, the installation today here at uh, Big E Food Corporation. <laughs>